1869, the study of DNA had begun with a young Swiss physician named Friedrich Meiser. Friedrich Meiser was born August 13, 1844, in Basel, Switzerland. Meiser was a very good student, but his studies were interrupted for a year when he became ill with typhoid fever which left him hearing impaired. He was shy, but very intelligent. He enjoyed research, but not working with people. Meiser actually wanted to be a priest, but his father made him go to medical school. When he graduated in 1868 from the University of Tübingen, Germany, Meiser decided to not work with people due to his hearing issues and decided to make his career one of research. Meiser's first research project took place at the Felix Hopp Seiler Laboratory, and it was the study of lymphoid cells, white blood cells. These cells are not easy to get from the lymph glands, but they were found in great quantities in the pus from infections. Meiser collected pus filled bandages from a nearby clinic. He experimented and isolated a new molecule, nuclein, from the cell nucleus. Meiser found that nuclein was made up of hydrogen, oxygen, nitrogen, and phosphorus, and there was an odd ratio of phosphorus to nitrogen. He was able to isolate nuclein from other cells. Meiser had obtained the first basic breakdown of DNA. This would have been remarkable enough. However, he went on to suggest how it also might be used in heredity. Meiser's downfall was that he was a perfectionist. He was always repeating his experiments and analysis and often hesitated for long periods of, of time before publishing his results. In his scientific career, which was almost three decades, Meiser published only nine scientific papers and only a few lecture manuscripts were printed. Meiser's results and ideas have been passed down through letters he wrote to friends and colleagues. Meiser did all the groundwork for the molecular discoveries.